this is going to be an alternate version of uh, the main riff of Holy Mountains. If anyone's heard this song before, you'll know it's very repetitive and it's fairly simple to play if five people could play it. I'll show you what I mean. This is the original. I know it sounds kind of cool, you know, but after a while, you know, once you get better, riffs like this are extremely boring to play. They're like no fun at all because they're just so easy. So sometimes it's fun to take something simple and like kind of do your own take on it, like spice it up a little bit. It's a real fun thing to do. You, you probably heard a previous video I did where I did a tapping version of the intro to Hypnotize. And that's what I'm kind of doing with this riff. It's easy and you, know, you mastered it pretty easy. So this is going to be an open string. This won't be a tapping. And you've probably heard me do a tapping video before, though. Tapping, you know, I'm good at, I'm good at it, but open string's more of my strongest point. Most of my really fast stuff, it's, it's going to be open string. So this will be the open string version of Holy Mountains. And you'll find just if I just do a... Just a tap, like a hammer-on type technique, it already sounds a hundred times better. I'll show you what I mean. Just a... Now to me that sounds like a lot cooler already, but I'm not entirely satisfied with that, so I'm going to add a few notes here and there and hopefully you'll like it. I'm going to start off with an intro kind of like this. And then I'll do the rest of the song from there. Well, there's that version. If you play guitar and you get tired of tired riffs, make your own version of it. I think you have a lot of fun with that when you experiment with that kind of stuff a lot. So, anyway, that's my open string version. I hope you liked it. Thank you for watching.